get her heard. A Stop by William Inge, Kansas playwright. Um, play was written around 1955, one of Inge's four sort of major plays, which make up pretty much his canon of work. And um, we haven't done an Inge play here in a number of years. And um, the play still works. It's a, sort of a bittersweet comedy. When you start to think about when he wrote this play, he really deals with a lot of issues and uh, candidly and frankly. There's no place I can hide. What? There's a man on that bus I want to hide. Oh, well, gee, I, I don't know. I'll just hide in the power room. If a tall, lanky cowboy comes in here, you can just tell him I disappear. But in, in the end, it's really a comedy. and. It is romantic, actually. It just has, uh, um, it has, uh, it examines love and life from uh, several different perspectives. These travelers on a bus who get sort of uh, waylaid at a bus stop, which is supposed to be somewhere near Lawrence, Kansas, actually, mm -hmm. um, because of a, a late winter snowstorm, like in early March. And uh, they're sequestered sort of between 1 a.m. and 5 a.m. in the morning and you get to know them and the people that work in the diner and um, there's an interaction and, and they sort of um, go through a lot of um, they go through a lot of emotional sort of issues it is comedy though I mean on, mm -hmm. on the, the basic level it is a comedy it's just got sort of a, a stronger serious underside to it I absolutely love to I mean the big one that I have I've got a lot of local references in it. Oh, they actually, they refer to Washburn University in the play like two or three different times. Well, it's the capital of the state, and it's almost as big as Kansas City. And there's a university, a museum, to, and uh, sometimes concerts and plays. And I go there every Sunday to visit my married sister. And actually, of all his plays, I think I really do like Bus Stop and. Um, uh, dark at the top of the stairs, the best. But Bus Stop is really a, a good mix of characters. It's a, a cast of eight, and it, it's got a sort of a wide-ranging um, emotional context for all of its characters. Good roles for students to work at. Really, some nice writing. Uh, really, an old-fashioned play, actually. Mm -hmm. Chris Waugh has come in to play Dr. Lyman, um, which is also good for the students to work with somebody who's a little bit more experienced, and it's sort of a plus that he uh, graduated from Washburn a number of years ago. Now that you want to treat the man you're going to marry, Jerry, shut the door, cowboy! That's no way to treat a fellow, Jerry. Slip off the bus like you're trying to get rid of me, maybe. Then come in here and eat by yourself. Well, I thought we'd have a whole snack together. Sometimes I just don't understand you, Jerry. For the hundredth time, my name ain't Jerry. Well, I can't say it the way you do. What's wrong with Jerry? It's kind of embarrassing. Cowboy! It opens November 7th and plays 7th and 8th and the 14th, 15th, and 16th. And tickets are available at the box office one hour prior to the performance, and it's in the Andrew J. and Georgia Nice Gray Theater on the Washburn campus.